before concluding his three-day working visit to Addis Ababa, where he joined other African leaders in participating in celebrations marking the 50th anniversary of the founding of the Organization of African Unity, African Union. President Yoweri Museveni accented to the African Union Charter, Vision 2063, that articulates Africa's roadmap on peace and prosperity for the African people for the next 50 years and enabling the continent to be the next frontier of globalization. The president had earlier in the day addressed the AU summit where, commenting on the International Criminal Court question on Kenya, the Ugandan leader recommended that the ICC drops cases against top Kenyan leaders because the tribes which caused the violence five years ago are the same tribes which united and voted overwhelmingly for Uhuru Kenyatta as their president. Mr. Museveni wondered what the ICC problem was when the Kenyan people had spoken through their vote. The Ugandan leader had earlier addressed the OAU-AU anniversary gala at the Millennium Hall where he commended African Union for supporting regional economic blocs like the East African Community, the ECOWAS, the SADC, ETC for ensuring rapid economic growth and development on the continent. We have attempted economic integration with ECOWAS, COMESA, East African Community, SADC, ETC. This is good. This is one of the factors the African economies are now growing at the rate of 5% per annum, while some other parts of the world are growing at miserable rates. He played growing tribute to the founding fathers of the Organization of African Unity 50 years ago for their determination in fighting for Africa's independence and to defeat white racist and apartheid regimes in Southern Africa. Thank you very much. While in Addis Ababa, President Yoweri Museveni held talks with President Jacob Zuma of South Africa, who came to meet him at his residence. Yes. Yes. The two leaders discussed matters of mutual interest. Mm -hmm. President Museveni also received a special envoy of the Russian leader, President Vladimir Putin, delivered by the Russian special envoy to Africa and head of his country's delegation to the OAU AU 50th anniversary, Mr. Mikhail Magelov. President Museveni was accompanied to Addis Ababa by the Minister of Foreign Affairs, Honorable Sam Kutesa, MPs Tom Azoa of Moyo West, Jessica Ababiku of Ajumani, and Grace Yarugaba of Isinjiro. I'm David Mutebire, reporting.